Got one. I got a crappie. <laughs> guys this is Aiden Rides and welcome back to a brand new fishing video and I've been really excited for this video um it's coming a lot earlier than I thought but we're gonna try and get out and get on some safe ice today I'm kind of getting everything ready right now I actually was just having me driving around um yesterday with my girlfriend and we were just uh up north probably about 40 minutes or so from my house and um it was obviously just cold enough the past week or whatever to get some safe ice up there because I actually had seen a few guys out um on some lakes yesterday so i marked a couple spots and we're gonna be going out find some safe ice and hopefully get on some big old crappie um and we'll see how it goes but yeah i'm just getting everything ready and uh got a little bit of a drive and hopefully we can find some ice did you make it through That is a lot of ice. All right, guys, we have found some ice. Uh, we actually, this is, it's so weird because all the lakes that we drove by, we started getting really nervous because, I mean, it was a, a good 40 minute drive or so. And uh, how much? Two and a half. All the lakes that we've been driving uh, around up here, getting up to the spot, have not been frozen like at all. Even there, there's ponds and stuff that weren't even close to freezing up. And this lake is, I mean, it's a, a, a decent sized lake and it's it looks almost completely locked up. So I don't know if we just got lucky and found this spot or what, but we're gonna head out and see if we can get some fish. I'm excited now, cause I didn't even know if we were gonna get the fish in the first place. All right, if we go out to our left, like this way, like that straight towards that water tower, it should drop off a little bit. couple inches maybe two and a half Got one. I got a crappie. <laughs> there we go. First, that's the first crappie of the season right there. That felt nice. He kind of came out of nowhere. We've been waiting for this is the first fish we've got all day. Um, I mean, we've only been out here for probably a half an hour or so, but there we go. First fish of the season right there. Definitely not a monster, but a success we came out caught a fish on the ice first fish of the season there we go all right guys we were able to get our first fish of the day um it's actually getting a little bit darker i haven't really told you guys what our plan is but we're gonna try and fish this night bite a little bit um, there was another guy on this lake that looks like he had just left. He was behind us over there. Um, but we've got some lights and stuff, so we'll be able to fish out here for a little while after it gets dark. But, um, reads out a little bit deeper. I caught that fish and it's only about a little over four feet here. And he kind of just came out of nowhere. I didn't even really mark him. He just came out of nowhere and ate it. So that's good though. First, first sign of, um, some fish around here. I mean, we're kind of just trying to follow this weed line a little bit. Um, we're a little bit limited to where we can go because the ice starts getting a little more sketch as farther as we get out. So, um, but there we go. First fish of the season, we did it.
got one. There we go. I got a second one, Reed. Second fish. I was kind of starting to think that that first one was just a kind of a <laughs> just a lucky type thing, but I mean, still, I think it was. I think we're just kind of getting lucky on fish that are happening to move through at the time because like that guy came straight up off the bottom and i think they're just moving through on the bottom here uh, we have been venturing out in certain areas um i think the reason why the ice was so sketchy out towards our first spot was because there's a little bit of like a hole out there and that ice just hasn't froze up quite very well yet but um i think we've kind of been moving around enough to know that like it's safe enough to fish i mean at first we were like holy crap like we're actually on the ice you know it's crazy i mean all the lakes around my house like i said there's nothing's frozen i mean not, not even close i've been waiting oh maybe is there another mark on me for the couple fish that have moved through i've been trying to get down there quick uh, just to see if there's any others that are moving through with them if it is a little bit of a school moving through I think the ones that we have seen so far though are just kind of random Random little fish that just happened to me cruising around What are you thinking? <laughs> I don't know dude I'd say like maybe like 15, 20 more minutes. Just once it kind of starts getting too dark, we can head back. Figured I'd just like fish like one more hole or something, then we can go. Are you ready? Get. Yeah. Okay. wasn't like unsuccessful I mean we had I think two crappie which I mean it's not like it was a amazing day but for first ice I mean we were able to get out like Reed said we didn't get skunked um, we found some safe ice so I mean it's a huge huge start to the season and um, I can't wait to see what's, what's to come for this season we've got a bunch of nice videos planned um, we're actually heading up to Red Lake um, coming up here next weekend uh, to go and fish for some walleye so that's gonna be awesome I can't wait for that and if you get, look hard enough like we did I mean you'll find a lake um, that's frozen I'm sure but just remember to be safe and uh, take everything you can to keep yourself safe like ice picks and um, spud bars and everything like that and uh, hopefully we can uh, get some better ice here soon but uh, it's gonna be good though this season I'm excited but Thank you guys for watching, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video.